This is because I, I left it open. Let's just close them. Close them all. Okay. So, hey, come on, close. Uh, if you want to edit emulators, you can uh, just click this uh, arrow down here and click Run Configurations and uh, choose a target to be manual or automatic. Okay. So let's let's pick a manual target and. Uh, Let's pick uh, this emulator. Okay. So now it should uh, launch the correct emulator. And uh, also you can choose uh, here in AVD Manager this emulator to be snapshot enabled so it, it will start much faster the next time you use it so here here is a notification okay but we don't want the notification we want uh, Jesus let me close this message so uh, text original equals uh, add original get text and remember to put a uh, dot to string at the end because get text uh, returns an editable something not good okay so it, it here says here to change the add the original to final because uh, we can't reference something like this so you can either click this actually let's click let's make it final here okay uh, now you have the text and we want to convert it how we do that well here I found a really nice converter I put the letters here, just type, uh, I know, English language letters. And uh, where are they? Ah. What? What is this? What is this? Anyway, just type here the alphabet. Okay, click convert, and here is a cool text converter. So A becomes alpha, uh, and uh, some other Greek letters, epsilon. I don't know. I forgot. So and now. Uh, we can copy paste this into a string string alphabet no this and we make a string alphabet array Al split and we'll split it but by space okay and copy paste this and get this one so convert it we save it as uh, another encoding good now let's convert this text and how do we do that actually let's make a for loop does it make sen sense what I'm writing here right so it's really not that hard actually 
these are upper charts so we might have a little problem here Okay, so now we can replace. So we have uh, old char with new char. Old char is uh, alphabet array of E, and new char is converted array of E. Now uh, that we have uh, converted the text, let's put it here in uh, the text converted. So I will convert set text text converted. Okay. Modify to final and. Uh, Let's test our application. Here is a, a DDMS perspective. Uh, you can choose it uh, with this button or click other and uh, choose DDMS. Uh, here in DDMS uh, are logs. So uh, if anything goes wrong, uh, here in log it will appear. In this version, there is also a filter that automatically filters uh, messages but hello well, let's click convert huh, it didn't convert why is that why is that indeed this alphabet lowercase too. Jesus, I'm I'm getting old. Now it should work okay. Okay, now it's working. Thoroughly. Let's also implement this clear button. Uh, now this is really easy. I guess you already know how to do that. Set on click new view on click listener. Remember to put a point and comma. How you say this in English? Point and comma. Point and comma. Okay. So we'll. Um, let's see, see clear set text clear text it doesn't set text hmm. it doesn't have a clear so I don't know will you set text uh, now what we can do uh, we can uh, use this share button so share okay so here we'll write our share button code let's test it for clear okay works okay so uh, for example you don't know uh, to do uh, something you just go to google and uh, under share button uh, text code and uh, this is 
not good. Ah, here's a good one. Let's just copy this. Just import intent. And uh, some uh, applications like uh, email, for example, also need uh, extra title. Also need. You can edit this, of course, by hand, but. Uh, And uh, the emulator doesn't have, um, for example, doesn't have uh, a Facebook client, so Facebook won't appear in the in the sharing uh, stuff. See, it's only, but if you have Facebook and other applications installed like Gmail. Uh, you'll get a pop-up window with those here so this is okay and for the button send SMS uh, just type this code it's also an intent doesn't matter what uh, tell number you put here and uh, when uh, it gets pressed this intent with the uh, SMS uh, will get fired also remember to add in manifest xml uh, permissions to send sms and this should be it your very first real android project